Have you ever stopped to consider what happens to your financial stability when you lose your job or face a significant reduction in your income? It's not a pleasant topic, but it's an important conversation we need to have. When you lose your job or have a cut in your income, it's like a domino effect on your finances. This isn't just about having less money to spend on luxuries, it's about having enough to cover your basic needs. The impact is immediate and can be severe, throwing your financial stability into chaos. To paint a picture, let's consider some figures. According to a study by the Federal Reserve, 40% of Americans wouldn't be able to cover a $400 emergency with cash, savings, or a credit card charge that they could quickly pay off. Now, imagine this scenario. You've lost your job and suddenly a $400 emergency isn't just a possibility, it's a reality. Job loss can lead to a chain reaction of financial instability. The first domino to fall is often the ability to pay for housing. Whether it's a mortgage or rent, it's typically the largest expense that people have. Without a stable income, it becomes a struggle to keep a roof over your head. The next domino is food. When money is tight, people often resort to cheaper, less nutritious options, or worse, skipping meals altogether. The impact on physical health can be significant, and it's a stark reminder of how closely our financial health and physical health are intertwined. Then there's healthcare. Without a job, you may lose access to your employer's health insurance. This can lead to postponement of medical appointments, skipping necessary medications, or even avoiding emergency care due to cost concerns. And let's not forget about other basic needs like transportation, clothing, and utilities. These two can become unaffordable in the face of job loss or income reduction. Job loss or income reduction can rapidly destabilize your financial situation, leading to serious consequences for your well-being and future. The domino effect is swift and brutal, but understanding this impact is the first step in preparing for and navigating these challenging circumstances. But what if I told you there are strategies you can employ to weather the storm of job loss or income reduction? Now let's delve into the various coping strategies you can adopt to manage your financial stability during such periods. First and foremost, having an emergency fund is vital. This is a stash of money set aside to cover the financial surprises life throws your way. These unexpected events can be stressful and costly. Here's where your emergency fund can come to the rescue. It's your financial safety net. If you've got one, great, keep building it. If you haven't, start now. Every little bit helps. Next, it's time to do a little financial spring cleaning. This means cutting back on non-essential expenses. We're talking about those subscriptions you rarely use, the premium coffee you could brew at home, the lavish dinners that could be hearty home-cooked meals. It's not about depriving yourself, but rather about making smart decisions to stretch your budget. Now let's talk about resources. There's a myriad of resources available for those experiencing unemployment or income reduction. From unemployment benefits to food assistance, there is help available. It's not a sign of weakness to seek help, but rather a step towards regaining your financial stability. Here's something to think about. A report from the Pew Charitable Trusts found that families without savings are more likely to suffer hardship after a financial shock. This highlights the importance of our first point, having an emergency fund. It's not just about surviving the present, it's about safeguarding your future. Remember, it's about managing the situation, not letting the situation manage you. It's about being proactive, not reactive. It's about taking control of your financial destiny, even when the winds of fate blow in a less than favorable direction. While the prospect of unemployment or income reduction is daunting, proactive financial management can help mitigate its impact. So stay resilient, stay resourceful, and most importantly, stay positive. You've got this. Unemployment or income reduction doesn't have to mean financial ruin. Remember friends, knowledge is power. Understanding the financial implications of job loss and preparing for it is half the battle won. It's not about painting a gloomy picture, it's about being prepared for the rain even when the sun is shining. Being proactive is key. Start by building an emergency fund, diversifying your income sources and learning to budget effectively. These actions can help ensure your financial stability regardless of your employment status. And remember, coping with unemployment is not just about surviving, it's about thriving. So, equip yourself with strategies that not only help you manage your finances, but also boost your mental well-being. In conclusion, job loss or income reduction is a hurdle, not a pitfall. It's a challenge to overcome, not a sentence to endure.
By understanding the potential impact of job loss and equipping ourselves with coping strategies, we can better navigate the financial challenges that life throws at us.